between the Redskins and the Buccaneers. Hello friends, Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. Just prior to kick off for this primetime extravaganza, and this adds another whole layer of excitement when you have this game on the lights. Yeah, it makes it more exciting for the fans. It builds up their enthusiasm because they're out there uh, tailgating all day, getting ready for the game, but also for the players. They lay around no matter what you do during the day. All you can think about is the game. How's it going to work out for us? So I think we're going to see a lot of excitement because of that. There's been talk all week long about this one, and finally, we're ready for kickoff. And he's taken down right at about the 29, not quite to the 30. He won the Heisman Trophy in 2011 out of Baylor, Robert Griffin III. Robert Griffin III, even if he couldn't run, will be a success in the NFL because this guy can throw the football. And Morgan's in the slot. First down and 10. He's got a little bit of daylight here. Here's the starting offense with a receiving core that can be so dangerous in a game like this. Davis is a tight end, but now shifted into the backfield. Second and four. Looking for an open receiver on the right. And a player to watch on this Buccaneers defense is, of course, Darrell Revis. Revis Island now down in Tampa. Wow, the best cover corner I have witnessed in the NFL, Jim, since I've been, been a broadcaster. We'll see if he can play the same here in Tampa as he did with the New York Jets. Offense lines up here. Three-step drop. He'll fire it out to the left. In on the stop. When you play zone in the NFL, what you're trying to do is make the quarterback hold the football just for a half a second longer, and you hope the pass rush can get there. They don't that time. That's why he got the completion. First down here after the completion. Tight end in motion. Griffin's going to take it from the gun. Looking to the right side and throw. Tackle down at the 42-yard line. You know, sometimes you got to call some passes that actually go down the field. You keep throwing it short. The defense knows you're going to do it. They come up and make the tackle for a short game. Nickel formation for the defense here. Second down and seven. We'll run it. Here's the handoff. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Third and three. Throwing now to his left. And they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. Quarterbacks love play action passes because the defense, sometimes they're expecting run. You fake it, easy completion down the field. Lined up in the pistol formation. 
way through this first quarter now. Bringing the play to an end. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap. And they hold that run to a short game. Nickel formation here for the defense. Second and eight. Hand off. They break through. Tackle them behind the line. Terrible call that time by the coach. The defense was expecting one. They were up there. They were aggressive. Found the line of scrimmage. And you just, you just played right into their hands. And they got the tackle for the loss. The Redskins will line up. The first down markers right at the 31-yard line. Setting up in the pistol on this play. Trying to work that left side. And he's going to be tackled right around the 31-yard line. Good job by the defense that whole series. They put the offense in a tough situation. Third long, they stop him once again. The Redskins lining up for the field goal. No doubt about it. Put three on the board. There's nothing like being ahead in the football game, no matter how many points it is, because now you can manage it in a different way, even though it's early in this game, and you make the other team come after you. The Buccaneers are about to get this game started with a return. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. Barkley's going to march onto the field. Now on first down. 38! 38! Down, down. Takes it from the eye. Breaks out of that one. A tackle behind the line. Here's a look at the offense. And if they're going to win today, this group of wide receivers must go vertical. They must open up the game for the offense. And the starting lineups have been brought to you by Papa John's, where you always get better ingredients Better pizza. Let's go. Martin is in the backfield. Working that left side. Challenges the coverage and has the completion. That time the pass is completed into double coverage, Jim, but the quarterback made a bad read. But these receivers, they are so good nowadays. That time, in double coverage, he went up and made the catch. It's like Bill Parcell said to me once about Mark Lamar, a very talented receiver. He goes, remember, Sims, when he's covered, he's open. He's coming, he's coming. Get ready. They've got a first down now after that catch. Play action fake, looking to throw. Should have had it. A player to watch today is quarterback D'Angelo Hall. I like D'Angelo Hall. He can play the inside receiver. Very aggressive. And there are times when he's one of the better defensive backs in the NFL. Man, man, man. Second down following that incompletion. Barkley's back in shotgun formation. Drops the pass. The defense has really done a good job here in this drive. They got this offense in a third and long situation. Let's see if they can convert it. Offense lines up here. Third and ten. The throw to the left. Secures it with two hands. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield. 
punt the football. They threw the ball, but still came up short. So now their punter is getting ready to send this one away. And as the first quarter comes to a close, we'll take a short break before the beginning of the second here in Tampa, Florida. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. And it was on this field back in 2009 where the NFL had one of its greatest Super Bowl finishes ever with Santonio Holmes with seconds to go hauling in the touchdown pass from Ben Roethlisberger leading the Steelers past the Cardinals. Michael Kanan ready to punt this one away. They'll take it at the 20. The Redskins offense now coming out. They come to the line, and it's first down. White sells the play pick and looks downfield. That's a gain of eight. That's a nice route on the outside. Nice throw by the quarterback. Puts him in good position to keep moving and get a first down. Redskins in the pistol. Second and two. Looks to his left. Brings it into his body. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Well, Jim, I always say it's about deception when you're playing offense. That time, the play action fake by the quarterback was so good, the defense didn't even see that he still had the football, and he throws it down there for a nice completion. The Redskins lined up in the pistol. First and ten. He'll get it out of the weak eye. And they tackle him down at the 37-yard line. An off-tackle run, it's a staple of all offenses in the NFL. And a general rule is you run off the right tackle because he is the power tackle where the left tackle is the pass blocker. Second down here after that run play. White's got it in the gun. As the reception all alone. Well, I think we've heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a passing league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to throw the football and pick up some first downs. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Here's the handoff and they'll run it. Going to lose yards here. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. It's now second down. Oh, let's go! Red 38! Red 38! White standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. He had it, but the hit jars the ball loose. That's why you like defenders who are good punishing tacklers. Make those receivers worry about coming over the middle. They'll be careful the rest of this game because of that big hit.
Let's see what they do on this third down situation. White is going to take the snap from the shotgun. Makes the catch in the open field. Jim, they got momentum on their side right now. They are making everything work. That was a nice play. They pick up another first down, and they got a good drive going here. Lined up in the pistol formation. First and ten. You'll get it in the weak eye for a gain of about five. That was a running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Second down and five. Kalu's got it on the handoff. The tackle was made, but the first down is picked up. Well, that's just a good old physical run by the offense there, and it's good for a few yards and gets them another first down. to snap it for the ninth play of the drive with two hands he has it when you have an offense like this that just keeps getting first downs not only are they moving in scoring position but they're giving their defense a lot of rest half time two minutes away This drive now about to reach the 10th play of the series. Sticks to his hands. Always a good job to pick up some yards when you're in the red zone. Nice throw by the quarterback and he gets the completion. Play after play after play here on this drive. White's going to take it from the gun. Eyeing that left side. Slips right through his fingertips. When you have a lead and your offense is playing like this, what's it do? Gives your defense a great rest. They're loving this drive as they sit on the sideline. Play number 12 coming up for the offense. White's back in shotgun formation. The ball's going to be incomplete. The hit knocked the ball out. I think the big decision is now, Jim, do you kick the football, take the three points, or do you go for it on fourth down? To me, you kick the football and get three points on the board. Should be what we call a gimme. The field goal try. Yes, sir. That was a nice long drive by the offense that time. And it stalls out. But good job by the kicker coming in and putting three points on the board. The Buccaneers are about to get this game started with a return. And he didn't get very far with that one. Only a run back with about 21 on the kick return.
it's a dime look for the Let's defense on this play. Drop back, shotgun formation. No separation at all. Incomplete. Uh, Got to give the defense a lot of, a lot of credit there, don't you, Jim? They are all over the receivers, all over the field, nowhere to throw it, and it just results in an incompletion. Martin's out wide on the left. Let's go. And out of the shotgun. Trying to work the middle of the field. Almost picked off. In these type of situations, when you're losing the game, it's third and long. Don't try to be a hero. Because when you try to be a hero, it's going to lead to a turnover. Then you really will be in trouble. Crabtree's playing out of position in the backfield here. Challenging the defenders to the right side. It's incomplete. The defender had it for a moment, but could not pick it off cleanly. Just stick the football on him. When you see a receiver run around like this, they're going to the corner, drive it, throw it on a line drive, so that way there can't be a mistake. That incompletion sets up a punt. He's going to try and return this one. The tackle is made. The Redskins getting set now for their next series. First down, offense readying for the snap. They send the tight end in motion. From the gun. And he's going to be brought down. Setting up in the pistol on this play. White's got it in the gun. And the throw, it's incomplete. Well, the quarterback's hurried on the play, and he throws it in completion. And QB had no chance, Jim, that time. No chance. The offensive line just has to keep the defenders off the quarterback a little longer. Henderson's going to get set in the slot for this snap. Will go Brown. He's going to be brought down, and that's going to be a three and out for this offense. The Buccaneers are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. The punt team is in place and ready to perform. Set up return. Here he goes. The Buccaneers will look to get set. Been a close game so far. The scores six to zero. Takes the staff from the shotgun. One for the home run. Oh, that could have been intercepted, but he couldn't hold on. They call that the moment of truth. It's a beautiful throw down the field, but the defensive back, he waits until it's time to make that jump. He defends the pass. What a good job by the defensive back. Second down coming up. Launching it deep. He brings it in. The Buccaneers call a timeout and a rough now 
with only one. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Now first and ten. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Count it. Touchdown. Tremendous show by the quarterback that time for the touchdown. What confidence he has in that arm. Small window. Very little room to throw that football in there. He didn't worry about it. Fired it. Got the touchdown. And we're going to have a stoppage here because the crew wants to have a look at this potential touchdown. Touchdown will stand. The Buccaneers will move in front with the extra point. Count it. Redskins are hoping for the big return to set up some scoring possibilities before the intermission as they've now fallen behind the scores seven to six. Smart play here, just take a knee. Henderson lined up now as a slot receiver. The quarterback will hand it off for about four. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. That's the end of the first half. And you've been watching the NFL on EA Sports, which is brought to you by Verizon. yards on both sides he told me that each team has struggled to get it done through the air and when that happens teams can pin their ears back and focus on the run danielle thank you very much now we'll go to the field able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. Buccaneers are ready to take over now as their offense heads onto the field. Watch the blitz, watch the blitz. Get ready. And Crabtree is usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. They feed the running back. I guess they think these short runs are 
like body punches. They're going to wear the defense down and start getting some big gains. I don't know about that. Watch the blitz. Watch the blitz. Martins, a running back normally, but this time lined up as a receiver in the slot. Middle. And they hit by a rack bow. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Now, looking at third down. The quarterback throws to the right. And it completion right there, but it really should have been an interception. Terrible throw by the quarterback. Terrible route by the wide receiver. Oh, wow, what a shock. The football was incomplete. The defense does its job, forces the incompletion, and now they'll receive the punt. Throws out of the yard, and that's a gain of 10. Redskins are getting set for their next possession. They've come out in the dime package. White standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. He'll fire it out to the left. Inhales the pass. I think the best thing to say about that play, it's just a, it gained a few yards, so that's what you do. All plays don't score. Sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards. The Redskins will go with the pistol on this play. Tossing it to the running back. There's the tackle, but still, it's enough for the first down. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game. to move the change after that last run. Back to the ground now on first down. Lined up in the pistol formation. Second down and eight. Gets it again here. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. Not much the offense can do in a situation like this. Third and long, what you probably will have to do is either surprise them with a run or throw it short and hope somebody can make a play and pick up a first down. Moss is now moved into the backfield from his usual wideout spot. And he's forced to the ground. I don't know what the quarterback was looking at. He had to know the defense was blitzing that time. Doesn't make a quick enough decision, and the defense gets there and gets the sack. Sack on third down gets the defense off the field. He's got a chance to return this one. He's brought down. The Buccaneers come onto the field now for this next series. 
Let's go. Offense lines up here. First down and 10. Play action. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Incompletion there. Just not quite able to get the feet down. That's a nice route that time by the wide receiver. Running the corner route, and the quarterback just throws it too far and misses it. Martin set now, split out wide to the left. Second down and 10. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. Has the catch, but the feet are not down. Well, these are the kind of throws in the NFL, Jim. You just take for granted that if it's open, you are going to hit it. But the quarterback makes a big mistake, leads the receiver too far to the inside, and it goes incomplete. Third down on the way. Play action. Looking to the right side and throwing. He's wide open for the drag. He steps out. That's what you want to do. Get a first down while you're on top and keep that clock moving and just controlling the football game. Good job by the offense managing things so far here today. This play set up by the long gainer. First and ten. Action fake. He'll fire it out to the left. And that ball's nearly picked off. But he dropped it. This is frustrating for a coach. You call a play, you get the receiver down the field on a quarter route, and your quarterback cannot put it on the target. Coming up, second down. Quarterback drops back, play action. Challenging the defenders to the right side. The Buccaneers now move the chain. When you talk about the play action pass game, it's really when you call it. you got to be in a situation where the defense is thinking run, and when they are, do you have the courage, or I should say the smarts, to fake the run and throw the football. Good call that time by the offense. Here we go, here we go. Watch, watch the blitz, watch the blitz. Get ready. That reception gave them the first down. The quarterback tosses it to the outside. Gain of two on the play. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting, and they hold the running back to a short game. Let's this go. will be the eighth play of this drive. They hand it off to the running back. Able to make the tackle about two yards shy of the first. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. Let's go. And Crabtree is a tight end, but lined up in the backfield for this play. Slashes to the left side. Hard to score a touchdown sometimes when you get in the red zone in the NFL. Why? Because the defense doesn't have to worry about passes down the field. The offense runs it. They are ready to get it done, and they do, and stop the offense for a short game. The offense is still on the field right now. Fourth down, and they'll need to pick up two. This has been a long drive so far. This is going to set up a change of possession. And as the third quarter comes to a close, we'll take a short break before the beginning of the fourth here in Tampa, Florida. back here in this low scoring 
affair. The long drive continues. Feed it to him again. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Mounting a serious drive. He gets it again on this drive. They're just grinding away down here, inching closer to the end zone. Well, that's what you got to do sometimes. It's hard always to think that you're going to come out and just make big plays. You've got to do the dirty work, and this offense is doing it right now. Play number 13 coming up on this drive. And he's in! Oh, you just love it as a quarterback. You get down in there and it's first to go and you score. Now you don't have to sweat the fact that, man, what are we going to do if it gets the third down? You don't have to worry about it. Good run. Nice touchdown. The Buccaneers getting set for the extra point. Makes the PAT. The Redskins ready to return the kick. Smartly takes the knee in the end zone. The Redskins in quite a battle here in the fourth. The scores 14 to 6. First down here. White's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Scans the field, and he's taken down. Nice job that time by the defense getting the sack. The blitz was well timed, and when it's well timed, the offense doesn't have time to react, and they get a good sack. Second down now. White's going to take it from the gun. Oh, scanning the field. When you're the quarterback and you see a blitz, you got to know you're going to drop back, look at a receiver, and let it go. No hesitation he is allowed. He hesitates, and the defense gets the sack. The defense comes out in the nickel. This is a screen play all the way. Jim, this time it's a halfback screen. Nice job by the quarterback. The halfback, good job after catching it, picked up some good yards.
Let's see how they back up the big play here. First and ten. He has the grab. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. It's just a good example of how the NFL has changed. If you want a big play, you don't always have to throw it down the field or design something special. The throw to these wide receivers short, we can see they're able to take short passes, break tackles, and with their talent, they get long gains. First down, following the long play. Now first and ten. Reaches out and snatches it. I think the best thing to say about that play is just it, it gained a few yards, so that's what you do. All plays don't score. Sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards. And Davis is moved away from the tight end position to now a receiver in the slot. No one in sight has the grab. Anytime your team is down, you're inside the other team's red zone, you look for one of your star players, your quarterback, wide receiver, or running back. They need to make a big play here. About to take the snap inside the 20. Here's the first snap after the big play. First down and 10. Looks around, sliding to get away from the hit. This is a time where the quarterback has to manage the clock, has to be very careful. Trailing, needing points to get back into this one. Big tackle for a loss. How about the defensive line? Getting that penetration, getting off the football at the snap, and getting it done, getting in the backfield and making that tackle. we reach the two-minute warning. Welcome back, and the defense trying to hold on to this lead with two minutes to go. This game is closing in on a finish, and the defense can make one play and basically end the game. Waits for an opening to unfold. This satisfying defensive replay is brought to you by Snickers. Hungry for victory? Snickers satisfies. Stands in the pocket. Another sack. Well, that's the sign of a good defense. When you can sack the quarterback and you're just rushing the defensive lineman, you don't need any tricks, you don't need any blitzes. Man, that's count. The Buccaneers get ready to start their drive. And Crabtree's a tight end, but now shifted into the backfield. Stiff arm. Brought down. Picks up the first as he's tackled at the 30. set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground left side he is tackled at the 40-yard line and here we have second down 
right back to him one more time. London Fletcher makes the tackle. <laughs> First down here after the run. Another carry here. London Fletcher makes the tackle. Bad job by the defense. They know if they give up a first down, the game is probably over. They get pulled and they give it up. Probably why they're going to lose. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Looking long. What? Touchdown, Bucks. Touchdown might just wrap it up. It sure will, Jim. It's been an exciting game all day. And it, uh, to score late in the game like this to put it away, it's time to celebrate a little on the sideline. The Buccaneers with the PAT to come. The point after is good. The Redskins await the kickoff after giving up a devastating score for their side. The scores 21 to 6. Buccaneers ready to boot things underway. It's a touchback and the ball will be spotted at the 12. The Redskins are set now for their next possession. Setting up in the pistol on this play from the gun. Stands in the pocket. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. They went for the deep throw, but the defensive back was there. Yeah, good job that time. I got to give the defensive back a lot of credit. He was not caught sleeping out there. He was alert, read the right keys, and he was right with the receiver to knock down that deep throw. Second down here. Here we go. Tight ends in motion here. White's back in shotgun formation. He's looking to the right here on this throw. And now they're in a hurry up. Third and four coming up following that completion. The quarterback throws to the right. The pass falls incomplete and they fail to pick up a first down on this series. The offense still on the field here on fourth down, needing four to stay on the field. And Morris is out in the slot. White's got it in the gun. Ooh, they failed to pick up the first, and the ball will go back to the other side. What a place to start for the offense. There's a lot of extra weight out there for this jumbo set. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Never 
Weber too late. That's a touchdown. Well, that touchdown just put the icing on the cake, Jim. Whatever you want to say, because now the lead's too big. Not enough time for the other team to come back. Great job by the offense. The Buccaneers now will tack on the extra point. It's good. The Buccaneers will have their kicking team on the field now. Their defense made a huge stop on fourth down, and that led to the great starting field position on a drive that would end with a touchdown. They'll take it at the 20. The Redskins offense now marches onto the field. A ton of defensive backs out here for this play. First and ten. Throwing now to his left. And the tackle is made right around the 39-yard line. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Almost to the 40 at the 39-yard line. One more play, and it's in the books. Here we go. One, two, one, two. Second and 10. To the ground here. He's going to be tackled right around the 42-yard line. That's it. This game is over. You've often talked about prime time and how the players of today have this it's all about me kind of a mentality and for you in the booth you had to enjoy it being all about you having a chance to call this one today in prime time <laughs> that's right it's all about me and it would have been if i could have just got you to be quiet for a few minutes but it's awesome to win in a game that's featured in everybody in the country all your peers they watch you it just doesn't get better Let's relive this one amazing play because it's our GMC Never Say Never moment of the game. For Bill Sims and all the crew at EA Sports, Jim Nance saying so long for now. <laughs>